You guys want to see my room? Okay, we are. We are gonna redo the girls' bedrooms. Just give them a smidge of a little bit of a redo. So let's go have a peek at the before. Any words you want the people to know before they see your before? We have been in the middle of like clearing it, so it's like it's really messy right now. Here we go. This is the before. <laughs> Holy mole, Isabella. Here's the before of Olivia's room. She will not be pleased with me showing this. However, in her defense, all of this stuff, other than a couple tiny little things, goes on the bed when it's made. So her room always looks much messier when her bed's not made. Okay, so all of the patches have been done. Look at all the damage that was on these walls. And now he's just starting to cut. We're doing three walls in a color called, what's it called? Uh, this is Greek something. Oh yeah, Greek Villa by Sherwin-Williams. That's gonna go on all of these walls in her bedroom and in the closet. And then on the far wall where he's working right now, We can talk about that. We're gonna do about from here down on this back wall a bright yellow color that she picked out. You wanna do you wanna do yellow in the closet too? Doesn't that look cool? I feel like that one look really cool. Other than you won't see it, because the top half gets shoved, jammed, That's stuffed not... with oh. with um stuffed animals. stuffed animals. So then you would see just like you put your dresser in here. Are you sure Wait, you still wanna I do see that? Like this much. Like my dresser goes like to here mm -hmm. and here. I, I actually look at this like every day and I think what a disgusting color. Like, well, yeah, but it's going to be painted. I know, but that's why I say I think that we should paint it bright yellow. I think that I just had a genius idea. Are you sure you want your dresser to be in your closet again? Yes. 100% sure. 100% sure. So we got her a new dresser recently. Oh, you can't really see it because it's covered <laughs> in all, all her clothes. That's the new dresser and it fits in her closet. So once we put it together, she's been keeping it in her closet. And these things hang beside it. Those are the only clothes that go on hangers in there? Yep. Okay, well, we'll see. Okay, so this is kind of the state of the house right now. We have purchased all the girls' furniture and kind of like the pieces we were replacing and put together their dressers and the, the desk and um, side tables and stuff like that. Jeff is now painting. He's patched all of the walls, made the repairs, now he's painting. And we have started the process of emptying out our lower level to begin our renovations down there. So I posted a bunch of furniture on my Instagram and we've been having people over all afternoon picking up items that they've purchased. So this is the state of things right now. We've had to make room. Look at up there is Bella's stuff from her bedroom. Hold on, I don't want to burn the popcorn. Give me a sec. bad right okay this is what's happening down here so we have sold this sectional that's getting picked up next week uh, we've got rid of this painting these two chairs here we just have uh, this table left down here to sell and this big console over here when we were cleaning out the basement yesterday 
We found this and so the kids were like, set up these speakers, they're so huge, we wanna hear them. So Jeff figured out how to connect an iPhone to this old stereo that he had when he was in high school. <laughs> and we were blasting music down here yesterday. So I thought that those were leaving yesterday. Now they've been set up and are new, so I have no idea if those are gonna be a part of the future of our home. This is what we spent some time clearing out yesterday. This, <laughs> oh my gosh. I spent a couple hours in here yesterday with some friends who came over to help. And we just purged this crawl space and believe it or not, <laughs> this is now it organized. Some stuff is just waiting. Oh, they squished my fiddle leaf tree. Look at that. This tree and this chair are gonna be used once the basement reno is done. But in the meantime, everything has been stored. So we're preparing for the renovation. Preparing. Okay, so this room this massive mirror we have decided to save and we're gonna put it in Isabella's room so that she can you know, have a little bit of a dance studio type vibe in her tiny bedroom. We still have to get rid of this desk. We haven't even talked about it. We'll probably post it online. But everything else that was in this room is gone. It's empty. Oh shoot, I gotta get rid of that too. Oh my gracious. Oof. So, this wall here is coming down. This wall will be gone. This wall here will be gone and this wall here will be gone. We're gonna open up to make this whole room down here bigger. This table does not belong to us. It belongs to our church. We borrowed it. We need to put it back. So that's the plan. Okay, this is where we're at. Two coats have been done of the white color and then we have taped off this square. This is where the yellow is gonna go, on the back wall, right there. This little guy's watching the whole process. because I don't want to paint over the over the tape. That would be really bad. How's it going? Good. <laughs> I've never painted before. Okay, so do you want to try? Yes, I want to try. Okay, first coat is done. The plan is to do a little pattern up in this section. Probably with yellow, but maybe with black. We're not 100% sure. Jeff is doing Olivia's room, so let's go see what's going on in there. Second layer of paint. <gasps> good job, Mom. That's good, huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, we are in the car. We just went to Home Depot. No, we no, did not. We, we went to <laughs> We went to Home Sense and Marshalls and got some decor we got throw pillows sheets duvets okay. covers blankets all the stuff no, no, for no, our no, um room Okay, 
here we go. Got some decor supplies for the bedrooms. This is gonna be good. Here's a peek at what the vibe of Bella's bedroom is. That's a little peek. It's a vibe. It's a vibe. Okay, now we have more stuff piled in the hallway because Olivia is clearing out some stuff in her bedroom to make room for her new grown-up space. No, this garbage. Oh, what's... Oh, the budget bin. Oh, I see. What are you doing, Liv? It's time for him to go. <laughs> it's time for him to go. Okay. Okay. It's cold. It's freezing. Oh, look, at it's so cold. Goodbye, big bear. <laughs> <laughs> She's kidding. <laughs> okay. All the things. Hi. Hi. Excuse me. <laughs> so excellent. How many how many builder bears you got? I think nine. One is in there. Do you need a shelf to put them all on? Oh my gosh, that's so rude. What do you mean? Oh, they all go in the bed? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, one. it's a sneak peek of your new room. Two, three, four. Good thing we bought those pillows, huh? Five, six. There's one in your bed too, seven. Which means I'm missing. <laughs> Gang's all here. <laughs> Good morning. It's a quiet Saturday morning and we have been spending the last week getting rid of stuff that we're not gonna need or that won't fit in our basement while we do the renovation. So anyway, this is what's happening today. The biggest item is getting cleared out from the basement and then demo can begin. This is getting taken apart and getting picked up very soon. Maybe. Maybe if we can figure out how to take it apart. I have no idea how it comes apart. Well, hopefully we can figure that out. Okay, this is the condition of the home. We have moved the TV from the basement up here because the basement is getting ready, you know, for all the things. Here comes the husband. Is this the rank cam? No, this is not the rank cam. Well, it is now. <laughs> this is day one and I'm already at my wits end. I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I'm about to lose it. You literally look so angry. <laughs> you don't even look like you're kidding. It's because I'm not. I've only seen Jeff angry once in his life. And it was through a window. <laughs> Wasn't even in person. <laughs> really? Yeah. What are you talking about? Okay. This is the condition of the unfinished laundry room. You know, it's like an unfinished space with a massive furnace. Children's laundry, because they're responsible to do their own and this is kind of what ends up happening. How about I do a rant cam about that? <laughs> <laughs> you, you haven't already? Nope, but I should. So furnace hot water tank, he's clearing this out. This is half of our crawl space. We're clearing this part out because we are getting a furnace that's gonna fit back here and a hot water tank that's gonna fit back here, which means it's gonna clear up all of this space so that we can figure out how we can include this in the finished portion of our basement. So here we are. It's happening. All right, I'll keep you up to date as this progresses, but in the meantime, pray for us. No, I'm, I'm kidding. We're gonna have a, it'll be fine. I'm not nervous one bit. I'll talk to you guys soon. <coughs> Good morning. We got kind of like furniture in random places. Here, let me turn this around and show you what's going on. We have some items that are gonna need a new home for the next little while, like a printer, some cleaning supplies, random things in the hallway. The girls' rooms are almost finished. 
We're gonna be doing the full reveal on that really soon. I'll give you a little peek. No, it's not ready. Just a little peek Mama, right no, no, there. No, that's my it. Bed isn't even ready. I know. I'm just giving them a little peek. Um, and then Olivia's room. It's gonna be done soon. But also, let's have a look at what's going on downstairs in the basement because it's on. We are doing a basement renovation. Come on, I'll show you the progress that we've made. So, hot water tank and furnace have been relocated. They used to take up this whole area here. Now they're way back in the crawl space back there. This wall is coming down for the most part. We've got some final things here that we need to get rid of, some front, bigger furniture items we're not keeping. He's taking the doors off right now, it looks like. This was my office for a bit. It is now back to the unfinished space that it was when we bought this home. We bought this home about 10 years ago. And this is what it was like when we bought it. The walls look like they've been primed. Um, and this carpet, <laughs> it's disgusting. We had an area rug over top of it. Anyway, all these walls are coming down. Let's see what Jeff's up to right now. Why? Well, what are you up to? I'm just taking the cover plates off of the receptacles and the light switches so that when we take the drywall, it's what you have to do before you take drywall down. So that's kind of where we're at on this Saturday. He's going to start demo really s soon. And we're gonna just start the process of knocking all the walls down. Babe, who's your uh, crew for this? Uh, me and my girls. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. In other words, me. That's right. I said to him, you're the contractor, I'm the designer. You do the grunt work and I'll make the pretty things. <laughs> but I'll help, right babe? Yep. A little. So that's kind of where we're at. I can't wait to give you guys a full, like keep you guys posted as this whole renovation progresses. But in the meantime, girls' bedrooms are almost finished. You guys will see those. I don't know who I'm gonna show you first, but starting next week, you'll, we will do um, two weeks in a row of the girls' bedrooms, all right? Talk to you guys later.